Oh, shoot. Please subscribe. Hey, subscribe. hey, like. yes, sir. Yeah, y'all read that right. Had to get up at 2.30 a.m., man. LAX is about an hour away, so I had to make sure that I'd be able to get there on time for my 6 o'clock flight. There I am off of two hours of sleep. I know I probably should have gone to bed before 12, but it's a habit at this point, man. Like, a shout out my mother, man, for packing me that lunch. Got the carbs and the protein. It was holiday week, so she and the family was able to come down to Cali to come visit me. I was on that plan for about four and a half hours until we got to Charlotte. Home of LaMelo Ball, Hornets, all that. And I had a little bit of a layover, so I was able to eat that magnificent lunch that my mother packed me. And then, yeah, I got back on the plane, flew for about an hour, Beautiful. Beautiful. and we got to Orlando. Fun fact, I had to spend the night at this airport once because I missed my connecting flight. It's a long story, probably for another day. And then finally, was able to get the, the rental. As you can see here, we got a nice little Corolla. And yeah, that's where we're at right now. I am so tired, y'all. I can't even lie to you. It's a long day, but finally got the rental car. About to go over to the hotel. It's about a 30 minute drive from here, so it won't be too crazy. But yeah, once we get over there, I'll just kind of update you guys on like why we're in Orlando and what we're looking to do over here. So yeah, I'll see y'all in a second. Just made it to the hotel. We got the sink right at the the door. Let's see what else? What else? We got a little bathroom right here. Let's check this out. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's a little. That's a little. A little iffy. Not an especially big room. Got some space right here. It's where I put all my stuff. Pretty big bed though, especially just for me. Not bad, not bad. Oh, what is that? Hey yo, hey yo. I give this room like a four out of ten. Like, it's got the stuff, gets the job done, but it's a little dirty. I'm not gonna lie, just a little bit. At least it don't smell enough like that in here though. Okay, so why are we in Orlando? The deal is there's a scouting event out here. Got tons of pro baseball scouts, got some of the independent leagues out and told that there's also some affiliated scouts, MLB type scouts out here. And pretty much the invite was extended to pretty much everybody who made the Zone 22 team to come out to Orlando and show what you got. Took the offer. Uh, it's a pretty it's a week-long event so we'll be starting playing monday gonna go all the way until friday show our skills do what we gotta do yeah i've been i've been hearing that people get signed out of this event so pretty excited to at least put my skills out there and see what comes of it you know but i'm not gonna lie y'all it was a long day like i said had two hours of sleep last night so I'm gonna definitely get ready for bed right now, catch up on the sleep that I missed, but I will catch you guys tomorrow. Not too much happened today, I'm gonna be honest. I'm at the mall right now. Just stopped over here because I need to do some homework, but you know, checked out the hotel, got a new rental car. Really just spent most of the day doing homework for referral, so didn't want to bore you guys with that, but yeah, the team Airbnb is finally open, so I'll be able to show you guys a little bit around that. Scouting event starts tomorrow. Feeling pretty excited. Really not nervous at all, for real. Like, I'm just, I'm just low-key confident. I'm just ready for this thing to pop off. But yeah, hopefully they'll allow us to have like cameras and all that, maybe record some at-bats. But if not, I'm gonna probably just update you guys on like, everything that happened about to go to the car right now and we will go to the airbnb right now so let's get it done
guess this is my room. I gotta kind of be quiet because everybody else is asleep, but it's like 11 something right now. We gotta get up around six, seven hours because we gotta leave out at around seven tomorrow. I'm about to get ready for bed, but I'm gonna catch up with y'all. Alright y'all, we just made it to the stadium right now. Bro, this complex is nice. Vlogging? Yes, sir. We vlogging. Just wanna say what's up. What up, oh, bro? What's up? Yeah. Mr. Baseball, what's up, boy. Good boy. Good boy. What up, what up, what up? Top of the morning, okay. top of the morning. Yeah, so apparently we went to the wrong field, so we gotta spin all the way back around. Uh, one by one, just make a line and just assign you guys in. Uh, just train it. What's your name? Quinn Davis. Davis. Mm -hmm. Okay, yep, I got you. Where's sure. Thank you. What's your name? It's warming up. Of course, supposed to be all sunny and yeah. I feel like I'm in Cali, man. I know. Cali's going to go over Cali. It's a lot I know. All right, y'all. So, just came back from the field. I wasn't really able to get too much footage of what actually happened out there. But I'm going to just kind of tell y'all. Had a decent amount of uh, people there. And yeah, the comp was pretty good. Like, guys were throwing pretty hard. Uh, they didn't really have us do too much today. It was really just like a evaluation type day. So took some IO, made some throws from the outfield, did some BP. So yeah, just for the rest of the week, we're just going to be having some games, playing against one another and seeing how we compete. I do struggle with stress when thinking about the whole uncertainty of, of everything. But whenever it comes to that, it really just has to come back to trusting that God is going to work everything out. It has to come back to relying on him and making sure that I continue doing what I do. I can't let the stress or the fear of uncertainty get to me and we will overcome this. It's going to be a good trip. There it is. Oh, there it is. Hey. Where? Hey. 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 Hey.